our God is never late. Our God is never early. He's always perfectly on time. And the Father's time in sending His Son, Jesus, to be born as a newborn baby to a 14 or a 15 or a 16-year-old girl, a virgin, that timing was perfect. Okay, so since our God is never late, He's never early, He's always on time, let's just kind of go back to Galatians, He purchased us out of slavery to sin, He redeemed us from eternal death, and now we're a part of His adopted family so that we can enjoy eternal life, and now we get to call Him Daddy, we have that close koinonia with Him, sealed us with the Holy Spirit, guaranteed an inheritance that is awesome, okay? So what does that mean for us? First Sunday, December 2020. What, what does that practically mean for us today? Our awesome God knows what He's doing even when we don't like it. That's the first thing, okay? Our God today, December 6, 2020, He knows what He's doing even though we might not like it, even though we might not understand it. Here's the truth. His timing today is just as perfect as it was when He sent His Son to planet Earth. You understand? His timing is perfect today. He, he knows what He's doing, and He has a perfect plan and a perfect purpose. And, and let me just say one more thing. If the Lord's timing was perfect when He sent His Son Jesus to take on a human body and be born in Bethlehem, His timing is going to be perfect when He sends His Son back to planet Earth and the book of Revelation kicks in. You understand? So, so if His timing was perfect when He sent the Lord the first time, here's what we know. He can be trusted that His timing is going to be perfect and precise and exact when He returns. And now He's going to be the King of kings and the Lord of lords. Just, just read a little bit of Revelation 20, 21, 22. If you want, need some encouragement, He wins. He's the King, and we get to rule with Him. Friends, let me encourage you today. Our God's timing is perfect. 